right, so I've got up nice and early today and I'm in the queue. Uh, it's the last home game of the season. And I'm uh, trying to get one of these Sinkara masks. So there's the queue, hoping we'll get one. So just been for a Starbucks, didn't actually get a mask, uh, which was a bit unfortunate because there was supposed to be uh, 20. And when the doors opened, there was only 14 and I was number 16 in the queue, so hey ho. Uh, but I'm going to rock a cardboard mask later and hopefully got myself on the waiting list for one uh, for all the Mexican people that follow. <laughs> um, I will get my sick car mask, don't you worry. The young man that's helping Manny on the uh, the um, Samosa Saturday in Ada Dementia UK and you've raised, am I told, over £20,000, which is absolutely wonderful. So everyone make sure we smash a like for this young man. But you're going to give us a match prediction, aren't you? And a goal scorer. So what are you thinking? I think 3-1 to Wolves. And who do you think is going to score? It is Lewis, isn't it? Yeah. Who do you think is going to score Lewis? Um, Neves. Uh, I'm not sure. But Neves is going to get one? Yeah. Fantastic. Right, brilliant. Keep up the good work, young man. You're, <laughs> you're an absolute inspiration. You really Thank are. You. So I'm with Manny, who's just set up at the Samosa, Samosa Saturday. I've just had one, absolutely lovely. Yeah. And this is James, who's also the ticket office manager, come down. Yeah. Manny, just before we start the yeah. game today, okay. have we got a prediction? Prediction, um, never back against, uh, back against your team, so they're definitely going to win. And I think 3-1. Euphoric day, uh, a, a nice. Rail's end. going to get the mask out. Well, he'll get the mask out no matter what happens. I think. I even think we're all getting the mask out even, today. Even if it's at the end, of masks out today. on the on the parade at the end of the uh, end of the match, I'm sure he'll all uh, he'll satisfy his fans' needs. And, I think um, he's going to get one today. Yeah, hopefully he d he does. I mean, he's. I thought he looked a bit tired recently, and then he came back. He with did. A he's got he's got motivation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And James. Go I'm going to I thought Manny was going to nick my prediction and I'm going 3-0. Oh. Jota's on fire, at least two for Jota. Oh, and as this is going to go out um, after the game, Manny, do you want to tell us about this special uh, short ride that you're going to make next week? Yeah, just, um, uh, apparently all the coaches are full and the trains are, you know, can't rely on them. So I've decided to get the dust the bike off and we're going to ride to Anfield on, on a bike. I've got a couple of fans now. I had one fan, but I've got two fans who will be egging me on and repairing my punctures and sticking food in my mouth. Are you looking yeah. forward to it? Obviously, it's going to be a Have great day. Have you got a day. ticket yet? Uh, no. Oh, I'm by the ticket. With the ticket off. <laughs> no, no, it's, I haven't, but the main thing is the ride and raising money for Dementia uh, UK. That's and, absolutely uh, my fantastic. My family will be there, so we'll celebrate the day, whatever happens. Uh, and you're going to make sure that you, you've got a, is it a Just Giving page? Yeah, I've got a Just Giving page. I mean, uh, you follow me on um, Twitter, Instagram, Manny Kang. Um, uh, oh, I'll have to get you on Instagram then, yeah. 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 And, um, yeah. So I'll put, the, uh, I'll put Manny's Twitter up on Thank here as well. Much. You can find the link. Manny, you've done fantastic this thank year you. with all that you've raised. Yeah, James, thank you to all the make sure he gets the ticket. <laughs> Brilliant. So look who with me by the Samosa store. It's Kev and Robbie. Uh, Kev, we're going to go with you first. You're going to give us a howl to start with. Oh! He's famous for his howls, aren't you, mate? What are you going to go with the score prediction and goal scorer? 2-1 Wolves, Jimenez first goal scorer. Love it. And uh, Robbie, what are you thinking? You're going to do is a reaction from representing the UK later. I'll definitely do that, and I hope it's a good one. Um, I'm torn. I'm, I don't know whether to go 2-0 or 3-0, to be honest with you. I'm optimistic. I'll, I'll go 3-0. I'll go 3-0. I've got 3-0. Who's going to score? First goal. Jota. Jota with the first. I don't know. Maybe a brace, and then a Jimenez goal. Fantastic. Brilliant. Literally, I forgot about this, but there is a comic on on in Wolverhampton today. I mean, look at this. So, actually, in the Graham store, just having a bit of an ale pie. There's Dad, there's Sean Connery, and they've gone with fish and chips. Just met another one of our subscribers, Dodgy oh, no, Dodgy Wall from London Wall. Lovely yes. to see you. Lovely to see you.
Hi guys, my name's Spencer, I'm one of Dazzling Dave's subscribers. Um, my score prediction for today is Wolves 3, Fulham 1. Um, Matt Doherty to be first goal scorer. As you know, if Wolves win today, it will secure Europe for them because they'll be clean 7th above Everton and Leicester. Um, I think that would be great because we need European football back at the stadium. And on my um, Wolves fan page, it is One Pack Wanderers with underscores in between the one and pack and in between pack and wonders come on the walls So it's a little bit windy, um, the team news is out, it's exactly the same team as we normally start with. The main exceptions are on the bench where we've got Will Norris who's on the bench as the keeper and Max Kilman is also on the bench from the academy. So depending on how the game's going we may see them, and you can see it's trying to take my, trying to take my hat off. Anyway I'm going to stick with my uh, pre-match score prediction of 3-0 to Wolves. The hat went 3-0 to Wolves. Neves, Jota, Jimenez. So Dudo is going to receive his honorary doctorate. We're with, is it Sinkara? No, it's Magic Moss. And Sean Connery, who is actually a celebrity, but well, there you go. So, uh, Magic Moss, dad, score prediction. One nothing. One nothing. 3-1. 3-1 to the Wolves, who's going to score? Uh, Giotti, Jimenez and Ryan Bennett. Jimenez. I'm wondering you're not, why you're not saying Bennett now. Oh, well, Bennett and then Jimenez. And it is Al Logan's 11th birth, Diogo Jota. We want your shirt at the end of the game, don't we, Logan? So as it's your birthday and Sin has come specially for it, He's there behind, look, in fact they're everywhere. Score prediction, Logan. Um, I'm going to go 4-2 Wolves, then still first, then Russell back. Fantastic, and for the final time this year, the legend that is Mystic Lily. Um, I'm going 3-2 to Wolves. 3-2? 3-2 to Wolves, yeah. Who's scoring? Brown and Dyer. And so two for Jota, two for Raul, or one for Raul and two for Jota? Two for Jota, one for Raul. <laughs> and there's, he's here, he's there, he's every... James! <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Four predictions. I'm going to give it 3-1, three, 3-1 three, balls. Fantastic. 3-1 one balls. Uh, Jota has got to score two. And Co Cody, his first shot all season. Going to get a penalty in the dying minutes. Fantastic. What a season it's been! Yes, it's been a Worldwide Wolves. We're now with Jean Matinho. Right in the crowd, right behind us, from Louisville, Kentucky. It's Michael, he's one of the subscribers. He's got his American flag. Kentucky Aki. Yeah, Kentucky. What, what are we thinking for the score? I'm thinking 3-1. How are you thinking about being here today? Awesome, it's the best feeling in the world. And you're going 3-1, score for Who's going to score? Who do you want I'm to score? I'm getting the Jota hat trick. You love Jota? Yeah. A hat trick from Jota, you're here to hear, and the American flag flying high from Louisville, Kentucky. Louisville.
blowing whistle and it's a, it's a half in which Wolves have pretty much completely dominated the game uh, from start to finish. We've had three, four, five shots, one off the bar in about the first five, ten minutes and looked to me like a stonewall penalty on, uh, on Jota, brought down, screaming for his ref waved on. About five minutes later, Jota went down again in the penalty area, but I think his frustration not getting the first one, he did try for that one, it probably was the right decision and not a penalty. Um, but, you know, all in all, it's been pretty good going, and um, I'm feeling pretty confident with regards to how we're doing, and I feel confident for the second half. It's just typical with regards to these sort of sides um, in the bottom six that, again, we can't seem to make that break through, and I hope it doesn't turn out the same way, but it's half time. I run out of battery right at the end there um, so I didn't get the uh, the players walking around the pitch clapping with their family but everyone pretty much stayed which was fantastic to see uh, Wolves got the win in the end uh, the goal from Dendonka great finish and um, that's pretty much secured Wolves into seventh place in the league which is an incredible performance really uh, from a newly promoted side just got to wait and see what happens in the FA Cup final now um, obviously, that will be my last home match day experience vlog of the season. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I do put a lot of effort in. It takes quite a while to put together and piece together. So please smash the likes. Please feel free to share. Tell your friends. You know, the more likes and followers I get, 
you know, the more it encourages me. And hit the bell if you've not already done so, because you will get notified first of all. But yeah, check out the um, the reaction with my dad. And when it goes up, please check out the international fan reaction, because that's a good one from this one as well, which will be coming soon. So yeah, thanks again for your support. It means everything. And um, we love the Wolves, wherever you are watching in the world. Really, really, my best wishes go out to all of you and um, your support for my channel is just overwhelming and it means the world. Come on, Wolves.